Hey guys, and welcome to Diecast Reviews. Today I'll be doing a review on Phil Tankson, who is the Nitroid Racer in Cars 3. Before he gets replaced by Tim Treadles, he comes with a bonus collector card, and he was one of the cards I did in my case unboxing. You can pause if you want to read that. And on the back, you have Manny McGear, who I'll be doing a review on. Pat Traxon, Junior Moon, Herb Kribler, Ed Truckin, and North Space Cruise Mirrors. I'll be doing a review on all of these. Now, Phil Tankson, in my opinion, he's probably one of my least favorite, or less favorite, uh, stock cars in Cars 3. Because he just looks really, really similar to Aiken Axler. The car is one counterpart of him. Really similar, so he's one of my less least favorite uh, stock cars. I don't know, maybe when they're all released, I'll have a better view. But like, Transbury Juice, he has a new number. Vinyl Two Pages has a new paint scheme. But barely, you know, so-so. Red Meeker, so-so. So those guys are towards the bottom of my list as well. But Phil Tankson is well towards the bottom of my list. So yeah, uh, I'm excited to get... Fail. But uh, anyways, I'm excited to get Phil Tankson out of the package. Nonetheless, I always like reviewing Piston Cup Racers. Um, and next gen racers anything to do with the piston cup pretty much i like reviewing them and the demolition derby so yeah let's get this out of the package whoa 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 whoa, whoa. You okay phil okay he looks okay that's not what I'm going to do. But uh, here's his poster that he comes with. The nitrate poster. High energy drink. And the uh, little slip thing. So is nitrate like, like, like is it like a Gatorade, Powerade? I mean, it has the aid at the end of the sentence. So is it like Powerade, Gatorade, high energy drink? I would assume that's what nitrate is. It's like, that didn't work. It's like Powerade, Gatorade. I think that is what nitrate is in the cars. Uh, world. So here's Phil Tankson out of the package. See, like, just look at that side. Doesn't that remind you so much of Aiken Axler? Just maybe a little squished up. That reminds me so much of a squished up Aiken Axler. That's why I don't really like him. I mean, to be fair, it is kind of cool now that I look at it to have, see a squished up Aiken Axler. But I don't like that he is so similar to Aiken Axler. But anyways, it's actually kind of cool now that I look at him out of the box. He actually looks pretty cool with the black. I might have to change my mind. Whatever. Uh, from now, for now, let's look at he, his paint scheme. Nitrate, high energy drink, of course. Lightyear, uh, silver rims like Bobby Swift. Piston cup, vital lean, revolting, RPM, nitrate, octane gain, and clutch aid. Number 28, nitrate, nitrate, high energy drink, nitrate, high energy drink again. Of course, he's number 28, as was Aiken Axler. And then this side is the same as the other. So... Nitrate doesn't have a cool slogan or anything like you're catching cold in my draft like Murray Clutchburn or what other what what else has a cool slogan? I don't know, but like you know some some have cool slogans like uh, that one like Murray Clutchburn is the only one I can think off the top of my head but So um, he doesn't have anything like that. So as we let's look at his design. He's mostly black but the roof of him is like orange fade to red or red fade to orange and the spoiler is completely red then you have this like flame design on the back of him with a little white design right here as well. A little curved white design and it goes on, the curved white design goes on the red. Now I don't know why, uh, it, what flames have to do with nitrate, but they have to do something I guess with nitrate. Now let's compare him to Aiken Axler. So there they are, and as you can see, he looks mighty similar. There's a bit of difference, but you would expect just a bit of, you would expect some difference. You won't expect him to have the same paint scheme. But you can just see how similar he looks. Like, Bobby Swift got a completely new paint job. Um, uh, Foveal Drive, completely new. Nitrate doesn't really look like they changed their logo, just had a bit more white. See the 28, all roof. Or the roof is all red and uh, orange now, so I'm just a flame. Same thing with the back. I do like what they did with the new roof and the uh, spoiler. That looks pretty cool. See the side. Even the side is just different colors, but the same flame design. Doesn't have the high energy drink logo anywhere except like there and there, I think, is the only place it says high energy drink. Here it says it on the back as well, which is pretty cool. So what what looks like um, Pixar did is like some of them they're gonna make really really good, like Lane Lock and Terry Cargas. 
and Tommy Highbanks in that, and then some they're just gonna copy the Cars one design, like Mur well, Murray Clutchburn, so so like Book Bearingly, Reb Meeker, Phil Pinks, and you know they just kind of copy the Cars one variant of it, and that's that's what the Cars three version ended up being. And uh, Phil, though, as I do look at him, um, Girl Zombie probably definitely better than Reb Meeker. And, um, yeah, so let's compare him. He is the same model as Reb Meeker, though. Um, does he have the camera in the back? Yeah, there's the camera in the back. I think Aiken, does he have a camera? No, Aiken doesn't have a camera, but uh, Reb has a camera. So, and he doesn't have a mustache. Although that could be actually his mustache. So let's compare him to Reb Meeker. So here is Reb Meeker. As you can see, they are the same model. Um, Reb doesn't have a mustache, though, in the front. And I don't believe Reb has a camera. Okay, no, he does have a camera. See, Tank Code has soothes upset tanks. Now, I don't think that's really a slogan. Like, high energy drink and soothes upset tanks. I don't think that's really a slogan. That's just saying what it is. But, like, like what? Um, I guess Menards. I guess not really Menards. But, like, you know what I'm saying. Like, Starbucks, if they would put something on there, they'd put, like, coffee. Well, that's a bad example. But, you know, you guys, I hope you guys get what I'm saying. Tank Coat is, like, soothes upset tanks and nitrate. Is a high energy drink, so that's what they're gonna put on the car. But like, mm, mm, blah, 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 I can't talk to Sp Sputter Stop. It has you're catching cold in my draft. I don't really know how that relates to Sputter Stop, but it's a good slogan, and it's a slogan. It's interesting, I guess to say the least. Um, I can't think of any more. I know there are more. I think Dirks and the don't. No, I don't know. Strong Fresh have one. I don't remember, but um, there are some cars who have it, so that's what I like about. Uh, and this thing does not want to stand. But that's why I like uh, the slogans. The slogans are always very cool. So now let's take a 360 of Phil Tanks. Well, let's just... Actually, first, I'm going to put some pictures up. Um, he appeared in the movie, I believe, in a couple scenes. Of course, he got replaced. He was one of the first racers to get replaced by Trim Treadless. So he didn't appear in the movie that much. I, did, I do believe he appeared in the Copper Canyon race, though. So now, if I can assemble this back together... Are you gonna stay in that? This 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 doesn't seem to want to go on here very well. But really, just just stay. Come on, thank you. I do like the posters though. I'm glad I uh, I'm glad the uh, posters come with the case L cars or whatever. Case, well, I don't even remember what case this is now. Is this case L? Is this no? This is case D. I think I don't I don't remember what case I bought. For some, that's, I know that's dumb, but what, I don't I don't remember what case I bought. I think it's case D. I, I do like that they came with the posters. I do like the collector posters. I was I, I when I when I bought Case T I was like I hope it's with the posters and they end up being with the posters. I think Case L is the um thing without the posters. Guys I have seen them here where I live. Uh Case L. Or not me, but my dad has seen them without the posters. So yeah, let me know. Do you like that um Phil Tankson and Aiken Axler have a similar paint job or no? I personally don't like it. I wish they'd change it up. I understand they can't change it up for any everything. I actually kind of do like the Phil Tankson design. I like it better than Aiken's design, to be honest. It, it's uh, it's way better, in my opinion. Um, but I do wish it may have been changed up a little more. But to be fair, when I look at them side by side, I kind of like it that Aiken's or that Phil's design wasn't changed up that much. So I'm going to rethink it being my like, least favorite um, stock car. So thanks for watching this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, let me know. Do you like who do you like better, Aiken or Phil? And do you think Phil's design should have been changed? So, um, thanks for watching this video, guys. Hit that like button, subscribe, comment, share, all that good stuff. Uh, let me know my question to answer to my question, I guess. Uh, which one do you like better, and do you think Phil's design should have been changed? So, once again, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you for the next video that I don't know what it is. But, bye-bye!